So for every computer scientist watching this video, I know you all started where I started. We all started writing that one application that every university, my university, a top 10 CS university, they all require you to do this as a very first test. And that is to write a Hello World application. Now, for those of you who are experienced or inexperienced, you all know that writing a Hello World application takes like 10 seconds, maybe 30 seconds if you're a little slow, maybe a minute max, but no longer than a minute. Guys. And for all the non-programmers out there, the Hello World application is basically one line of code that you write just to understand that, hey, you can write code to make a computer do something. And the Hello World application is so simple. I'm about to show you how to write one right now. So I'll use this console.write line hello world and you run it run it bang nice and easy that took 10 seconds but i wondered there's a service out there known as upwork upwork is a platform where you can earn a lot of money doing jobs for other people you can be a computer scientist a doctor a firefighter a website developer an author a writer anyone and all you have to do is find a job that fits your attributes and you can do that job and you can set an hourly rate. So say you see a job where a person's like, I want you to develop a website for me that does ABC and you are a website developer. You can ask the person, hey, I can do this job for you and I'll charge 75 an hour. And I'm telling you, people have made hundreds of thousands of dollars on Upwork. So then I wondered if I posted a job on Upwork asking a developer to write a Hello World application for me. How much would they charge me? How long would it take them? Hello world. Assistance. Project. Hello world. Location that. To. I will also need to be able to see your code. And understand your implementation. So really I'm trying to sound like the most beginner programmer that's ever coded in his life. Let's see if this works out. So on Upwork what you can do is you can select the tags for whatever project you have. I'll say software design, uh, JavaScript, and that's really it. Entry level. Any specific skills I'm looking for? Nice. Nice and blank. It's okay. Pay a fixed price. My budget, I'll say uh, $50. So this is our final post right here. Uh, the title, the job category, the description, everything. Uh, I think it's pretty good. So it's the next day and I'm about to see if anyone actually accepted my job offer and whether anyone's actually willing to write this Hello World application for me for some money. Two proposals overnight, one by Norman and one by Pamela. You can see Pamela charges 20 an hour, Norman charges $3 an hour. So who should I really pick? Uh, let's see. I'll go with Noman just because he's cheaper, right? I'm not trying to spend too much on a Hello World application, really. So I sent a message and I'll see how long it takes him to reply. So after some time, I was waiting to see if he replied, but he never did, you know, for a good amount of time. But then Pamela actually reached out to me asking for the job offer. I didn't record that part, but I ended up messaging her too and asking her to complete this task. So I didn't hire anyone. I just asked them some simple questions as to like how long it would take, how much money it would cost. And they all sent me this. One hour is first of all way too long for this to take. Like writing Hello World takes 10 seconds. So charging $20 or even like $10 or $15 to complete this task is totally absurd and not worth it. But you know, I'm gonna keep going at it. I'm gonna see what these developers do. I'm gonna ask them, you know, if they can cut the price down and let's see what happens. Oh, uh, this is kind of awkward because what happened was that I actually checked my Upwork account like uh, 30 minutes ago and my camera was dead, but now the battery's back. So I can record this video. And one thing I saw was that Pamela actually gave me the code to write Hello World without any cost. Now, looking at the chat, I don't know if she meant to do that or she still expects money. Like she literally just gave me all the code for Hello World and she made a web server. So she did actually a little extra than what was needed. Like all I really was looking for was a console.log statement. But since it's JavaScript, she actually made a web server and it's kind of neat. You know what she did was kind of neat. A very simple though, a very simple task. And I'm in an awkward position where I'm like, so do I pay her or do I not pay her? Because I never hired her technically. One thing I did notice was a missed call. 
So I think she still wants to talk to me, whether to explain her code or to ask for money. And you know what? I should pay her money and I should pay her the $20. As you can see, there are developers out there like Pamela who will give you the code for free. And there are other developers like Norman who may charge you a little bit. But all in all, I'm pretty sure they're both great developers and they're just trying to help me out. They probably think I'm a knowledge developer. So props to them for even accepting the job. I'm pretty sure many, many developers just saw this and were like, yo, this guy's a scrub, forget him. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. You know, this is a new type of video. Very interesting to me personally, seeing how, like the market for the Hello World application since it's such a basic application. But we saw, you know, what transpired and hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you want more videos like these, more in depth, everything, just give me some ideas and comments below. Like the video, share. Peace.